I'm up here in the Angeles Crest today in the high mountains above, uh, well, to the east of Los Angeles at mile marker 30.02. And if you park there in the tiny little parking lot, you can take a trail that goes steadily up into the mountains. And it used to be uh, that there was a beautiful experimental pine forest up here. Um, but a few years ago it burned down. And, uh, but it's still a beautiful hike, a beautiful air. The smell of the living things in the mountains just can't be beat. And so I had a good walk today. And uh, on the way up the, the road to this turnoff, I went past an accident. This is a windy road. It's the Angeles Crest Highway, Route 2. It's a windy road that's frequented by motorcyclists and bikers, as well as sightseeing cars. And there on a curve of the road, a young man had had an accident. Maybe he was in his 20s or early 30s. And uh, he was lying on the road. And uh, there were emergency vehicles clustered round. And it looked to me like he was about to leave his body for this time around. So I pulled over and I, I wished him speed, Godspeed in his journey, whether it was to healing in the hospital or to departure and to disincarnate form for a while. I wished him the help of his guides and his healers. And then I went on to go on this hike. And all the way up the hill here, see it's, it's a big hill. I don't know if you can tell. All the way up the hill I was thinking how evanescent life is. How little time we really have. How the time sp speeds by. <laughs> and how each moment counts so much. How we have to decide why we're here. What is our soul's purpose? And what we really want to do with our lives. How we want to spend each moment, you know? It's pretty important. You never know how long our assignment's going to be. So, that was my thought for today. And my thought was, I'd really like to spend it walking in the mountains and chanting God's name. That's just my idea. I can't think of anything grander. Whatever your idea is, whatever the best thing is for you, I hope you have a chance to do it. I hope your life's not cut short before your soul's purpose can be achieved, you know. And I hope that young man who was lying there so still on the road, I hope he had a chance to achieve something glorious before he passed on. Or if he went to the hospital, that he still has a chance to do it. Y'all take care.